and welcome my name is Stephen as you can see I'm a bow wallpaper today we're going to install the latest version of LibreOffice which is LibreOffice 4.0 now there is no PPA, PPAs or um, repositories for this yet apart from the beta version but I'm sure as soon as one is out it will be uploaded on web update OMG Ubuntu etc um, so to start, if I pull up my notes, we need to get rid of the previous version of LibreOffice, which is on mine is 3.6, as I'm as I recall. So just open the terminal, and you need, you need to have to be using sudo command. So sudo app get remove double dash purge libre office dash core and libre office office dash common entry password either type in y I'll just hit enter and just leave that Now this would have gone a bit quicker but obviously because I'm screencasting it's taking a little longer. Right, now we just need to do the do a sudo app get auto remove command. The, Page variable, and that will just make sure there's nothing existent in the auto remove. That's to do with LibreOffice. So now we just need to go to your uh, open up your favourite web browser. Now, mine isn't Firefox. I prefer Google, but this is a clean install. So you just need to redirect your browser to LibreOffice.org, and it should come up with a similar page to this. Uh, maybe even this page really. And once you're on this, once you're on their site, you just click on the download LibreOffice now. That's in this corner here, and it should automatically select your architecture, the system you're using, and your language. So all you need to do is then click on what says main installer here, click on that, and save it. Now, whilst that's downloading, I will pause this video and I'll continue in a moment. As you can see now, LibreOffice 4.0 is, is not installed, sorry, but it's downloaded. So we're just going to close this. Now we need to go back to our terminal. Let's clean my screen. And we now need to go to the downloads directory, which is the CD downloads. Now we need to Unpack. Tar, sorry. Unpack the LibreOffice um, package. And to be fair, it's not dot dev. It's dot tar dot gz. Yeah. So tar dash x vzf. Libre. You can start typing out and just tab out so you get the full. Um, it's full file name and extensions. Just hit enter. I know I've got sudo in here, but as I record, I did I put sudo? Yeah, I did. I always put sudo before anything, just to be sure on the safe to be on the safe side for any commands that need a root access. So now we just need to go to need to change the directory to our library office one so just again cd type in library and tab out again and then hit enter and then cd and in capitals type depths and hit enter so now you should be if I show you visually you should be inside this directory so if we close that now, I'll clear the screen again. 
we need to install and package it. So you've got sudo dpkg-i and instead of typing anything out just put an asterisk dot deb hit enter and boom it will install that and it's going to install every debian package that's in that directory which there's more than two dozen at least so whilst that's doing that I'll pause and I'll you'll rejoin when it's finished once again now as you can see it's finished inst um, installing them through the dpkg command um, but problem is we type in LibreOffice or we don't get anything other than the LibreOffice directories etc so if I clear the screen oh. we need to install the desktop integration the dot desktop files so you can use it through you through the Unity launcher etc etc so to do that we just need to cd into desktop just type out desk whatever and type it out to get desktop integration hit enter now the dk this dpkg command just pull that back up and hit enter or type it out again and that will install and set up the icons etc for LibreOffice as you can see now that's done and just to verify it that's installed as you can see applications LibreOffice 4 base calc impress etc um, all you need to do if you want to you can add them to your launcher a simple way of doing it is to run the software and then right click lock to launcher and then there you go you got it in your thing in your, launcher, in your Unity launcher now all you need to do now is to go back to your downloads folder just by hit typing in cd and that squiggly wave line and then cd downloads then rm oh yeah you can't remove that can you Cause you need to remove whatever's inside so if we remove Debs. Oh well, you can see what the idea you can remove remove all them source files and debonims etc. Um, boom. LibreOffice 4 is now installed in your system. So enjoy. So thanks for watching and please subscribe.